Frances Perkins was the first woman cabinet member. She served as FDR's Secretary of Labor for 12 years, so from 1933 to 1945. Uh, what some people don't know is that she actually had Maine roots. Her family had been in Maine since the 1700s, and the family homestead is located in Newcastle, and our office for the organization is in Damariscotta, that's so fun. that's that's why we're there. And one of the things that um, Perkins and FDR, of course, saw was that you were going, you were in the Great Depression and people were struggling and Eric will talk a lot more about the, the history of that, but that there needed to be programs to help people um, survive, uh, whether they were old or they had lost their jobs. And so for Perkins, Social Security was one of her key policy legacies. When she was approached about becoming Secretary of Labor, she, she had uh, what she called her list of practical possibilities, and on it was creation of Social Security, unemployment insurance, the elimination of child labor, and establishing a minimum wage. So it was a comprehensive kind of Very package. Big list, yes. But she considered Social Security to be her greatest policy legacy.